Hey guys, Wells Knight here, bringing you the brand new episode in my Lord of the Rings Online Bjorning Let's Play. In this episode, we are going to be doing this, a bunch of quests in the Southern Barrow Downs. Last episode, we were in the Northern Barrow Downs. I'm down here at Dead Man's Perch right now, where some of the guides are. I've already grabbed all those quests. So we're going to go ahead and head right into the Southern Barrow Downs, which is right up over here. Do do up on the mount riding and there should be the first quest that we're gonna do like right over here to the left which is to search for Omluk who's a dead guy you can see him over there There's a couple skeletons for us to dispose of right away and we will go ahead and make use of our lovely bear form to finish off those guys. All right, then we will examine his body. And then we're going to head right back to the guides so that we can quickly turn this one in because we will get sent right back out to go take on another quest in, in that little line. So, we want to make sure that as we're running around the rest of the Southern Barrow Downs, we can continue this questline. So now we'll search for Malin, or Malin, or however you pronounce it. But there's several different quests that we'll be doing here. There's some stuff in the epic questline, we've got some bounties, we've got the search for Malin, we've got all sorts of stuff. So, we are going to take care of this stuff as we go we'll come on down here and we gotta kill a bunch of bar guests and a bunch of barrel whites so first let's do the bar guests hopefully we will not be oh I'm rooted right now I was trying to move and I'm like why can't I move Probably because I'm rooted, that would definitely do it. All right. So we've got a marksman over here for us to take care of. All sorts of different barrel weights and things. And we're just going to kind of fight our way through the barrel downs. Actually, let's grab a couple of quests. There's the bone man. I'd almost forgotten about that one. Um... And then there is this one. Let's do that, I think. Oop, I am in combat. Oh, it's just a rat. Not too worried about the rat. Ooh, and I have a deed that was completed there. A couple different things we can do to get a class trait point. Got another marksman here to get rid of and take care of. Do do. Do do do. Now, all of these whites and marksmen and bar guests and all the stuff for these bounty quests over here, they have a random chance, a fairly high random chance, of dropping the quest items I need. But it is possible that they might not drop it. So. These quests can either be pretty quick, or they can take forever. It seems to vary. But I think we are going to head down to right over here, and then the Craybane and its master. Is that in the Northern Barrow Downs? Oh, it is. Oh, man. Okay, that's all right. Another bar guest. Bad doggy. Trying to all bite me and stuff. Not very nice. Not very well trained dogs around here. Do -do. Now, guys, I do want to let you know that. Uh, when this video goes up, it will be Tuesday, and 
it is the middle of finals week for me, so I have a lot of texts, uh, tests, and papers, and things like that that I have to be taking care of. So I'm trying really, really hard. I'm working really, really hard to see, to still get my two videos on the channel up every day that I try to go for. The only day that I only post one video is on Sunday. Um, and that actually may be changing in the near future. I don't know yet. But I do want to let you know it's finals week. So if I am unsuccessful in getting two videos up a day, it's not because I don't care. It's not because I'm trying to slack or anything like that. It's because, I mean, obviously my studies do have to come first. But the good news is that after finals week is over, I have nothing but free, but, uh, free time until spring semester starts up in mid to late January. So I will be putting out all sorts of good stuff over the winter break, over J-term as we call it here, uh, because, you know, time on my hands. Might as well invest it into my channel. Um, might even try and do an entirely new series over winter break and see if I can get the whole thing done. We'll see. Um, I'm also going to try and do some... I guess you would call them like special edition Lotro episodes where they're not part of this Let's Play or part of any ongoing Let's Play per se. They're just kind of little snapshots of other things that I'm doing. Um, I do that occasionally with my Minecraft content where I'll do like a special edition episode that isn't part of any series and isn't ever going to be part of a series, but it's just kind of a little, a little thing. Like for example... Uh, for a Lotro special edition episode, you might see me run a raid on my captain or something, or, you know, you might see me exploring Gondor in my hunter or, you know, whatever it may be, something along those lines. So keep an eye out for one of those, maybe a couple of those over the course of winter break. Those are always kind of fun to do. Plus then I get to show off my super amazing captain who was totally, completely geared out and awesome at level 95 and then I kind of fell behind the leveling curve when I stopped playing for a while so I've got some work to do there maybe uh, maybe maybe that's what I'll do maybe I'll do some episodes showing my level progression on my captain as I work to get my captain up to level 100 which I think is something that I might just do over winter break that might be a good idea I don't know I don't know. Let, let me know what you guys think about that. In the meantime, I am going to continue killing off these Barrow Whites and all these nasty critters and thingies that are in the southern Barrow Downs here trying to make my life generally miserable. We should have Malin over up this way, I believe. Hopefully I can get to him without triggering a bunch of fights and basically getting destroyed since these critters are a little bit over my level at the moment. Oh, we got the Journal of Cardolan completed. That's good. Always good to get deed completion. And actually, I should probably turn that on. We've got even more Barrow Whites. So basically, this whole little pathway up here to Malin is just filled with them. And I could try and sneak by and get through without fighting them all. But my experience in the, in the uh, past has been that that usually doesn't work very well. Because one of them sneaks up just like that. And you basically just kind of get wrecked. Especially when more and more and more of them get involved. So we are going to try and dispatch this guy pretty quickly here. That should finish him off no problem. Then we'll sneak up here and talk with Malin. Oh, and I am fairly damaged. I think I should still be okay, though. Especially if I get into bear form here in a sec. Which I think is a good idea. Let's go ahead and do that. Oh, please don't pop up here. Okay. I thought that Barrow White right over here was going to uh, come up and just basically interrupt my honorable one-on-one -on -one combat with Malin there. Luckily, he decided to stay put 
Because that could have been kind of disastrous. I was already kind of hurting from everybody else. So, it's a good thing that he decided to go along his merry way and leave me alone. Now, I've got enough white, skill, uh, white skulls for that bounty quest. I need some more Barghast Eyes, and I need some more Relics of Cardolan. Relics of Cardolan primarily drop from little small critters like these tainted rats. There's also some quests down this way where I can fight bears and things. Um, I think I'm going to go ahead and remove some of these. I think we will add in the Bone Man quest and, let's see, seeds from corrupted trees. Corrupted trees. Yeah, I guess we'll fight some of these bears as well. Don't really see any reason not to. I do wish that we didn't have to kill 24 large barrel crawlers, though. That is a lot of barrel crawlers. Although, to be fair, you do get a fairly decent number of them popping up from killing the bears. Because every time you kill one of those bears, three of these guys pop up. So, could be worse. It's just kind of a long and arduous quest. But I see another air, another angry bear over here. I spy with my little eye another angry bear. We're going to try and pull him over here so that he does not get us involved with that great barrel crawler you see over there in the distance. And we'll have a bear on bear fight. And then we'll start dealing with some of these guys. And we should now have six barrel crawlers and two bears down. Silver, but I'm just going to leave that one be, I think. I think what we'll do is we'll head over this way and deal with the Bone Man. And I think I'm going to use my healing skill here to try and regen a little bit. Because I am kind of hurting. These guys are all a couple levels higher than me. But usually, you can take on pretty much any mob, or at least any non-elite mob, on your own, as long as its name isn't purple. Um, red, you can usually take in one-on-one -on -one fight. I mean, if you get swarmed by a bunch of them, then you might be in trouble, but why do I keep removing those skills from my hotbars? That is not what I want to be doing right now. It's like the seventh time that's happened now. I'm a little rusty, I must say. But it's okay. We'll uh, take care of these large barrel crawlers that are in the way, as usual. And let's find that skill that we uh, accidentally put away. I believe it was Biting Edge, right? Yes. Okay. So there we go. There's another angry bear right over here on our way to the Bone Man. So we only need a handful more bears. We gotta kill the Bone Man. And hopefully, between these quests, we'll be able to finish off the other quests for like the Relics of Cardolan and all that good stuff. That's what I'm hoping. Looks like we actually do have the Cardolan Relics one already finished, so that's good. Ooh, that was probably not a good decision. I'm going to have to keep an eye on my health here. Because I'm kind of hurting just a little bit. Get rid of this tainted field rat that's bothering me. Build up some wrath, I think, and then use it to pop our healing skill again. Okay, I think we're all right. We're, we're still surviving. We're still around. We're okay. I seem to have missed a, a batch of great barrel crawlers, though, because I've only got 13 of them. Did I miss? Eh, whatever. I'll find more later. 
We've got more bears over here we can handle. And actually, I'm pretty close to leveling up here. And we want to make sure we get all three of these guys. All right, so that puts us to 16. So we'll have 19 once we take care of the last bear. So we're going to have to kill a couple of them on the side here. But they're kind of all over the place, so that shouldn't be a big deal. There's another bar guest. We need one more of those. So let's use our ranged aggro, our ranged force taunt to get him over here. There we go. And that's a level right there. So we will... I don't want this hobnatigans thing. I tried that out in an earlier episode, and it's something that I'm sure I probably could have done when it first came out, but now it's very hard to find the people to do it. Because people have lost interest with it, I'm thinking. And we've got all sorts of nasty things that we can deal with. Yeah, 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 go away. And no. Oh, leave me alone. Pop-up quests. Oh, and a deed completion. Cool. There's the bone man right over there. So let's go fight him. And I think this fight is definitely going to be a fight for bear form. And that ought to do it. Goodbye, bone man. So now we need another bear. We need a couple more barrel crawlers. And then we're good to go turn in a whole bunch of quests. So let's handle these barrel crawlers that I see lying around. I think we're going to need three of them. So two more and then a bear, because the bear should spawn three large barrel crawlers for us to kill. So we'll need one more. And I see the bear. Ah, uh, nope, that's a great barrel crawler. I need a large one. Hmm. That's alright, we'll sneak over here and take out this bear. Because I think this will at least get us very, very close. If nothing else, I mean, I suppose we could always just kill an extra bear or two. That wouldn't be the end of the world. And that bear would spawn those large barrel crawlers for me. Alright, so there is the bear. We've got another large barrel crawler here. And it actually looks like we are going to need... Oh, there's one. Is there another one hiding back there? Nope. We're getting close, though. We are very, very close. Great barrel crawler. Great barrel crawler. I need a large, not a great. Barrel white. Barrel white marksman. Uh, you can never make it easy on me, can ya? Alright. Well, I suppose... Oh. This is... This is a great barrel crawler right here that's come to make me angry. All right, we will use this for... Oh, and there it is. I can see it in the distance. I should have just done that, but oh well. Oh well. Only one more angry bear. And then he'll spawn a, late, a large barrel crawler, who I will dispose of post-haste. And there we go. We've got that quest all finished up. Let's jump onto our horse and get out of here. Time to head back to Dead Man's Perch to go turn all of these lovely quests in. And then I think we will go ahead and call it an episode. So let's see how much experience we get. I think we'll have enough... I don't think we'll have enough to get to level 20, but we'll have enough to get pretty close, I'm thinking. 
because we have a total of seven quests to turn in, I think. Something like that. We have a pretty good number. We are going to want to finish up the other epic quest, but I think I will do that. I think I'll do one more episode in the Barrow Downs, and then I will move on. Some of this I'm going to do off camera, like the uh, the other bounty quests. You can, uh, you can repeat those a total of twice to do them a total of three times, so... Um, I, I will probably do those off camera just because there's no sense in showing the same quests three times each. But we'll swing over here, turn this stuff in. And Bob Red Thistle will Good give evening. us a quest completion there. Would you do something for me? We will take these great barrow quests as well because you know that we're going to be doing uh, stuff sorry, in the great barrows once it opens something. up because group content oh yeah good stuff all right we'll take these journeyman tailor scrolls as what well try and get us some nice recipes that we can make use of Stay we will grab all of Could these I quests yet again would you do something for me as well as that one. And I think I am going to go ahead, guys, and end the episode right here. So if you enjoyed this video, don't forget to like, subscribe, or leave me a comment. I really do appreciate it, and it definitely helps me out. You can also find me on Twitter and Facebook. There will be links in the video description below, so check that out as well. Otherwise, guys, thanks for watching, and I'll definitely see you next time.